Unit One. Family life. Page six. Getting started. Activity one. Listen and read. Hello. Hello, Nam. This is Uncle Lom. Is your dad there? I'd like to ask him out for a game of tennis. Well, I'm afraid he can't go out with you now. He's preparing dinner. Is he? Where's your mum? Doesn't she cook? Oh yes, my mum usually does the cooking, but she's working late today. How about your sister and you? Do you help with the housework? Yes. We do. In my family, everybody shares the household duties. Today, my sister can't help with the cooking. She's studying for exams. I see. So, how do you divide household chores in your family? Well, both my parents work, so we split the chores equally. My mother cooks and shops for groceries. My father cleans the house and does the heavy lifting. My sister does all the laundry, and I do the washing up and take out the rubbish. Really, it's different in my family. My wife handles most of the chores around the house, and I'm responsible for the household finances. She's the homemaker, and I'm the breadwinner. Anyway, I have to go now. Tell your dad I called. Bye. Oh yes, I will. Bye, Uncle Long. Unit One, Page Seven. Getting started. Activity Three. Listen and repeat the words or phrases. Rubbish. Washing up. Laundry, household finances, groceries, household chores, heavy lifting. Unit one. Page eight. Language. Activity one. Listen and repeat. Tr. Trash. Tree. Train. Treat. True. Cr. Create. Critical. Cream. Crane, crack, br, breadwinner, breakfast, brown, brother. Brush. Unit One. Page Eight. 
Language. Activity two. Listen to the sentences and circle the word you hear. One. Her brother borrowed her motorbike and crashed it. Two. The crane has been there for quite a while. Three. I like bread with butter. Four. Is it true that he quit? Unit one. Page thirteen. Communication and culture. Activity two. Listen to the TV talk show. Who said what? Good evening. Welcome to our Happy Family program. Our topic today is roles in the family, and our guests are Mr. Pham Huang, an artist, Mr. Nguyen Nam, a teacher, and Miss Mai Lan, a doctor. Now we'll hear what they think the roles of the wife and husband are in the family nowadays. What do you think about this, Mr. Pham Huang? Well, in my opinion, in the family, the husband is the provider, while the wife is the homemaker. Her job is to look after everybody in the family, and take care of the house to make sure that it's clean and neat, and that the family has good meals every day. So you mean the wife has to do most of the housework? What do you think, Miss Mailan? Well, I don't think so. Women's roles have changed. They also work to share the financial burden with their husbands, so their husband should share household duties with them. I see. What do you think, Mr. Nguyen Nam? I agree with Ms. Mai Lan. Homemaking can't only be the job of the wife or the husband. Both should join hands to provide for the family and to make it happy. Unit One. Page fourteen. Looking back. Activity One. Listen and underline the words that have the consonant cluster sounds tr, br, and cr. Write tr, br, or cr. Above the word that has the corresponding consonant cluster sound. Then, practice reading the sentences. One. After having the ice cream, she brushed her teeth. Two. The car crashed into a tree near the traffic lights. Three. Try this new dish created by your brother. Four. They often have brown bread for breakfast. Five. That brave young man likes traveling by train. Six. Is it true that the crime rate is increasing? Unit one. Page eleven. Skills. Activity two. Listen to a family expert 
talking about how the roles of men and women in families have changed, and decide whether the following statements are true or false. Today we'll discuss the changes in roles performed by men and women in the family. Changes in family life have made men's and women's roles more alike than ever, as the wives are also responsible for the family finances. Family experts say the old notions of who does what in families may be more and more unclear. Men are not the sole breadwinners for the family like they used to be, and they are becoming much more involved in housework and parenting. Because men and women's roles in families have become more alike, for couples to balance their work and family life, perhaps equally shared parenting is the best solution. Equally shared parenting. Means the conscious and purposeful sharing in four domains of life. One. Child raising. Both parents have equal responsibility to nurture and to take care of the children. Two. Breadwinning. Husbands and wives' careers are equally important. Three. Housework. The household chores should be equally divided between the wife and the husband. Four. Recreation. Both partners have an equal chance at time for their own interests, and of course to be with each other. Experts have found out that families that can keep to those four principles of equally shared parenting become happier, and the divorce rate is the lowest amongst them. Unit one, page eleven. Skills. Activity four. Listen again and answer the questions. Today we'll discuss the changes in roles performed by men and women in the family. Changes in family life have made men's and women's roles more alike than ever, as the wives are also responsible for the family finances. Family experts say the old notions of who does what in families may be more and more unclear. Men are not the sole breadwinners for the family like they used to be. And they are becoming much more involved in housework and parenting. Because men and women's roles in families have become more alike, for couples to balance their work and family life, perhaps equally shared parenting is the best solution. Equally shared parenting means the conscious and purposeful sharing in four domains of life. One. Child raising. Both parents have equal responsibility to nurture and to take care of the children. Two. Breadwinning. Husbands and wives' careers are equally important. Three. Housework. The household chores should be equally divided between the wife and the husband. Four. Recreation. Both partners have an equal chance at time for their own interests, and of course to be with each other. Experts have found out that families that can keep to those four principles of equally shared parenting. 
become happier, and the divorce rate is the lowest amongst them.